Sunday to this, 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 everybody down on South Street, there's this artist who's been building these mosaic walls. And, well, that is another part of Philadelphia. I'm sorry. Yeah, buddy. But about, a, about 10th and South is the most amazing thing I've seen in a long time. This whole structure, this mosaic structure, I can't explain it, but I felt like I was swimming in art. I wanted to take off my clothes and go skinny dipping in art. It was public. Let's take likes down spruce or turns them south. We'll go down to the market and get food for miles. Bread, tomato, mozzarella, cheese, sit on the porch and wait for the summer breeze. It really comes around and I'm so damn hot. I've been sweating all day, I've been sweating all month. The neighbors are getting angry, they're doing the shout, trying to push the summer. Keep back out in Philadelphia. City of the East, city of brotherly love, city of the police, Mumi Al Jamal was still on the throat. 25 years and they won't let him go. And it's six by itself with the toilet on the wall for two minutes a week to make one telephone call. Blood in her hands, evidence revealed, old conviction stamp. How many innocent in prison, and how many more because of an OJ trial they could not afford? Fill the jails, sell the schools, fill it up. Fill it up. Like a well worn shoe, I'm slipping right in place. Every one of those 3,000 miles, I was wishing, I was wishing, I was wishing, I was wishing. members of keys to one door. All these years never been ripped off, making a garden out of abandoned blocks. Empty builds into squats, buying old houses and trusts in Philadelphia. I played this song last night in the city of Philadelphia, the city of brotherly love, the city that loves you from behind. I played this song there last night and and I and then there were these these people there, you know. Mischief group fans, I can only I can only guess. And uh, and, and they knew the words to the Philadelphia song. I was very flattered. I thought, well, this is great, man. I'll just play the guitar. They can sing. Cool. And, the, and, and, the, and they got to the part and they sang that. You know, they sang, there's a cult that's been the 30 years or more, over 300 members have keys to one door. All, all these years never been ripped off. And I said, how many of you are members of the Mariposa Co-op? And I said, how many of you know what the Mariposa Co-op is? No. <laughs> Which is, you know, curious. They live in Philadelphia. It's a song about a food co-op. I mean, it's not, you know, the, the most, you know, seductive of my numbers. I mean, a song about a food co-op. I mean, you know, I, guess I had to tie in a few other things, but really what I'm talking about here in the song, and the core of it is the food co-op, you know. Because this food co-op is amazing. It's, in fact, there used to be 300 members. Five years ago when I wrote the song, there were 300 members to this co-op, and now there are 637, I was told last night. And the co-op is tiny. It's 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 this tiny little place, and everybody. They, 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 ooh, we got a little ringing there. Maybe we'll just drop the whole the level. I don't know. Who? 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 Yeah, do you hear that? I hear that. I want to talk about it. it might make me feel better. There's, there's, there's this co-op. It's a tiny little room, and everybody who who is a member of the co-op has a key to the door. And when you go get your food and your produce and your oats and and, the, and whatever you want to eat, you don't pay cash. You write down in the ledger what you want, and then you go away. You lock the door behind you, and then once a month you pay your bill. 600 people do this and somehow the place has been floating for a long, long time. And they teach us in school that people are in inherently greedy and cannot do anything and that we're all best off if we act in our own self-interest. Well, the Mariposa Co-op is singing another song and I am always excited to hear that they're doing well. And if you're in Philadelphia, go drop by and check it out because it's really a sight to behold. How about here in uh, New Brunswick? Any funny co-ops? George Street. George Street Co-op. Right, all right. Any members here? 
Okay. We have one member. Okay. I better fucking pick up the pace here. We're talking about co ops. I was about to say, anybody want to, you know, have a board meeting? That's where I was headed. It is a rock and roll show after all. I'm going to do my best to step up the pace. I had a Guinness before the set. You know, the Guinness is marijuana of beers. You know, so I'm just like so fucking mellow right now. I'm just, uh, I hope I can even finish this song. I'm thinking about quitting right now before I can get to the second chorus because I'm feeling really good, you know? Well, what this young man to my right, your left, was talking about, on 40th of the Locust, there's a small little bar called Fiume. And please do drop in to Fiume sometime. It is my favorite bar in Philadelphia. Maybe my favorite bar in the country. It is always happening. Fiume has this feeling, wherever you're there, things happen and they feel important. When I, the last time I was there, this guy got up and sang a bunch of songs from Central America. I thought, this is different. You know, this is cool. I like this Fiume place. But it's always been like that, so drop in 40th and Locust sometime. At this bar on the corner of the band, there's a night, the place is always real packed, makes me feel alright. They keep beer in the freezer, like a cold one right now, and miles away, just feeling pleasant out of Mission Philadelphia. Mission Philadelphia. Like a wild war, she won, slipping right in place. One of those 3,000 miles, I was wishing, I was wishing, I was wishing, I was wishing, I was wishing. I was wishing. Thank you. 